YouTube video looking on how to make a paper boat using origami. First, you're going to take your piece of paper, you're going to fold it in half, okay? Lengthwise, in half. Make it a nice tight fold, nice and specific. All right. And then you want to fold it again. Nice tight fold. I usually like to use my thumbnail to make it a little bit tighter. Then you're going to open it up again. So again, full piece of paper, close the piece of paper. So the bottom end is the one that's open. Then you're going to take your top corners and fold them in so they're pretty much right up to the line that was your fold. And give it the old thumbnail to make it nice and tight. Same thing to the other side. Try not to go over that middle line at all because that will cause you problems later on. There we go. So now it looks like, hey, it's pointing up at me. So again, open, close, fold them down. Now, with the open fold towards you, take one of the pieces of paper, one of the sections, and fold it up right along the bottom line of that triangle, those triangles up at the top. So it should be nice and even all the way across. Again, I'm going to go over that to crease it a little bit more. Okay. I'm going to flip it over and bend those two little triangles down towards you. Okay. So again, folded it up, folded it over. Now we're looking at the back. I'm going to take this remaining little bit of single paper and I'm going to fold that up as well. So these two lines should be pretty even. Okay, fold that with my thumbnail. Then I'm going to reach in with either my fingers or my thumbnail or whatever into the middle. And I'm going to make it into a diamond shape. Okay, once again, don't drop your phone. I pull and bring it around so a diamond shape. Then I'm going to take my front bottom corner and I'm going to bring it up so that the top and the bottom, the bottom meets the top and then I'm going to crease it so I still have a square. Turn it around, do the same thing. I have a triangle with some nice tight creases. Same thing as I did two steps ago. I'm going to reach in the middle. I'm going to lift it out. And so I have a smaller diamond shape. Really, it's a square, but it's a diamond. And this time, up at the top, I'm going to grab the two outside top corners and I'm going to pull out. Now you may have to help a little bit on the inside, creasing it down so that the final creases along the bottom are even. And then fold it, fold it, and you have yourself a boat. It's not necessarily supposed to sit up straight and flat, but it will if you do it in the tub. That's how she is. Good luck to you. Happy boating.